Good evening, Heidi. Heidi, hello. Do you listen to me? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> I, uh, good evening, welcome. I was trying to check my my audio and I said probably she's kind of busy right now, but we still have one minute, one minute left to begin. And this is the last week. So Ada wrote that she has a surgery and she's not going to be able to. I don't know who is writing at this moment, but I don't know, because it is only one number, it is not a name, so, you know, some students are like that. Ah, Freddy is in Ana Claudia, hello, welcome. How are you? Connecting. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome to the Thank last you. classes. Let's see, Wendy. Hello, Hello sis. Hi. So, how are you? Wendy just wrote hello. <laughs> Okay, welcome to the class. It is exactly the time, eight sharp. So people, how was your weekend? Tell me. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome, uh, Miss Veronica. Thank you for joining the class. Okay. Miss Wendy Patricia is here. Hello, Wendy. Okay, I am going to... Hello, good evening, good evening. And here we go. Ada is not here yet. Ana Claudia. Here, teacher. Thank you. Andres Alberto Orellana, not yet. Cesar, not yet. Fatima, she's not here yet, okay. So let's see. Francis, Francisca, Delmira, not here. Fredis, David Rivas. Here, teacher, good evening. Okay, good evening. Heidi. Here. Always in class. Hugo, not yet. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, welcome. Thank you for joining. Karen, not yet. Liliana, okay, not yet. Probably soon she's going to get connected. Lorena Guadalupe, Loren. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, Lorena. Maria Milagros, not here. Mauricio, not here. Patricia Janet, not here. Sandra Caroline, Later on, maybe. Veronica, here. Now, here, no, more, now no more homework for your daughter, Veronica. No, yeah? no, no. <laughs> okay, relief, what a relief. Okay. Thank Wendy, you. Wendy, Wendy, Patricia. Good evening, Good evening teacher. Okay, here you are. Sochil, not here. Yolanda, hmm, maybe later on, okay. Okay, people, so today we're going to get started with the last unit of your book, 
okay, of this uh, module, which is about um, accounting. So the people who are involved in that area are going to be very useful for the partners because there are some terms that are specialized, yes, for that area. And the rest are going to learn those terms. So let's get this started. And I am going to start with the, the screen. But before we go over, Lorena, how was your weekend? Lorena? Nice teacher. Nice teacher. Nice. Okay, great. Did you relax? Relax. Okay, because today is Monday. Hey, next week, vacation, right? Holy week. Yeah, so are you having vacations, Lorena? Next week uh, at um, work? Yes, yes, okay. And Veronica, are you having vacations next week? I work. No. You work, good. And Wendy, yeah. are you going to have vacations next week or are you going to work? Yes, next week uh, I have vacation. Okay. All, all week. Okay, great, congratulations. And Miss Ana Claudia? Uh, no, teacher, I work the whole week. <laughs> okay. <laughs> for us, it's like normal days. And fighting for your goals, yes? Yes. Okay, right. <laughs> because at the end, you see profits. Very exactly. Well. And uh, Heidi, you work, right? Next week. I work until Wednesday noon. Ah, okay, yeah, because uh, the banks close, yeah? Only a mm -hmm. couple of days. And Freddy's mm -hmm. continue working next week. Yes, teacher. I okay, working. great. Now, people, listen, I talked to the administrator, the one that uh, gives a follow up to this group, and she said that they have fixed the situation in ah. homework number 15, 15, exercises one and two. And she recommended me to tell you about the period. And I told her, I always tell them not to forget the period, okay? So maybe you're not going to have troubles, yes? And remember, if you are still owing some homeworks, you still have time, okay? You can do it continue working, the exercises are not, you know, too many, just a few, okay? So work on that because they help you in your grade, everything counts. And also the minutes that you are in class, okay? In order to keep the, the scholarship for your next uh, level. I can confirm it's working because I just fixed them. And, and I just, uh, uh, it, 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 they were correct. What happened is that uh -huh. in order for the system to, uh, to accept it, fresh, uh -huh, I take so, off the period and put it back again and then submit it. And now it's working. Okay, great. Now you're going to get 10, yeah? Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> I hope so. I hope okay, so. Okay, <laughs> congrats. In that exercise, at least, okay? Uh, yes. <laughs> you know, I am not the platform. The platform is in charge of the scores, yeah? Oh, so, really? I thought that you yeah. were the one looking at the platform? No, it is the platform. I I check, but ah. I check the, the scores. It is automatically, ah. yeah. The same as oh, in, the, in the groups good to here. Know. Yeah, it is the platform that creates the groups. It is not awesome. me, so don't blame it on me. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so that's why I always say, when you ask me for help, Regarding to the platform, I ask for help to the administration. Uh, yeah, that's okay. why, because it is on them. Okay, so nice. here we go. Let's begin. And believe it or not, people, today we are in our video conference 16. Only four more are left. Yeah. And after vacations, you're going to be in module five. So congratulations because you have been constantly in class. And let's see, one volunteer to read the agenda. Who wants to read the agenda? Hello. Only one volunteer to read the agenda. <laughs> Me, teacher. Okay, Wendy, Wendy. Okay, uh, 
Good, good evening. Uh, agenda number one, sharing agenda. Number two, objective. Number three, feedback. Number four, what up? Number five, accounting vocabulary. Vocabulary. Uh, number six, vocabulary. Vocabulary. Uh, number six, wrap up. Wrap up. up. Wrap up. Remember it's, that it's we, don't pronounce, we don't pronounce the W, okay? Wrap up. Wrap okay. up. Wrap up. Hey, that's it. Wrap up. You forget about the W, yeah? Thank you. <clears throat> and here we go. So, who wants to read the objectives? I'm Only going to read. Okay, okay, great, <laughs> Tunisia. Okay, Ana Claudia begins and later huh? continues Lorena. Okay, okay, so Ana Claudia, the general objective, and Lorena, okay. the class objective. Okay. Okay, general objective. Uh, students will develop competencies that will allow them to describe features of products, describe process about selling or buying online, know customers' opinions towards products they sell, and have conversation with others about financial activities. Thank you, Lorena. The class objective, please. Class objective participants will be able to describe financial activities that my company or some else has. Very well. So the idea is that you will be able to describe the financial activities that my company, in the case, everyone's companies, right? Uh, or someone else's has. And here we go to the feedback because Veronica was absent last Friday, we're going to have the feedback. People, this, are, uh, this question goes for everybody. Help me remembering what we did in the last class, okay? What do you remember about the previous class? So who wants to begin sharing? Me, teacher. I yes, remember. Please. I remember we started the use of did and didn't. Yes. Okay, what else? Who wants to help Heidi? What else did we do? Eh, yes, Miss Ana Claudia. No, Freddy, Freddy. Ah, Freddy, please. The boy, okay. <laughs> uh, what do you remember? Something that you remember about the previous class, okay? Um, I remember you find the missing letter for the complete words. Like a pick up the phone, call, plane, the help, the fees, the bike, okay. Yes. The get price, from clean, the assistance, on the phone, on the phone, the review information. Okay, very well. Thank you for okay. the effort. Okay, so we were practicing vocabulary and you work in the completion of some words, right? Yes? Okay, great. What else did we do last uh, Friday? Do you remember? I remember, I remember, teacher, I'm sorry, uh, that we were combining and working with the structure, the questions were using the auxiliary verb did with a negative and, a, and or affirmative way, but we convert the same sentence in using the uh, verb on the past uh, form. Past form. I don't know if okay. it's okay. That uh -huh. was the simple past. The simple past form. Uh -huh. We were converting them on. We were working on both way. Using did and also using the, the simple past tense. In affirmative. Yeah? In affirmative. Uh -huh. Yeah. Questions 
affirmative and negative, right? Uh -huh. Sentences, very well, okay? In order to practice the past tense of the verbs, great. Okay, so right now we're going to go over the warm up activity. The objective is to get the students into the mood of being instructed. You are going to work in a small groups right now and try to brainstorm about this. What a financial statement is. Let's think about uh, money. Let's think about uh, a financial issues in a company. And then let's start guessing, okay? Trying to guess what financial statement is. And later we're going to discuss it in class, right? Ready? Okay, so, ah, hello, Yolanda. Welcome. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Uh -huh. So I'm going to create three groups because later on maybe someone else is going to join. Okay, so here we go. And let's see. Okay, so do you have any question about what you are going to be discussing? Pregunta sobre lo que van a discutir. What a financial statement is, but try to guess. Don't look it up in, 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 in Google, okay? Try to use, you know, your own ideas. Otherwise, you're playing a trick. <laughs> yes, I have Ms. a question. A, a yes. financial statement for my company or for me? In, no, in general, ah, what, okay, what okay. you think, what ah, okay. comes up to your mind when you listen, listen to that phrase, financial statement, ah, what okay. is it about in general, okay? Okay, okay. Okay, but you have to discuss. So here we go, let's see. And I have three groups. In group number one, Ana Claudia, Lorena, and Veronica. Room number two, Heidi and Yolanda. Room number three, Freddy's and Wendy. Okay. So I'm going to open the groups. And at this moment, get ready because I'm going to send you a message. Okay. Go to your small groups. And here we go. Okay. Wendy, you need to go to room number three. Wendy, Wendy, Patricia. Hello, Wendy. Wendy, do you listen to me? Wendy, Wendy. Okay, okay, great. Ah, Fatima, hello. We are working in a small groups, okay? So I'm going to assign you to a group. Le voy a asignar a un grupo. Do you listen to me? Yes. Yes, Fatima. Okay, listen. You are going to work in group number two, okay? You go to group number two. Okay. Go to your group. Group number two. Okay, great. I just were revisando. I didn't, I didn't uh, review the this class in the page uh, manual page number to be nice. Mm. I, I look out. I look out cash flow. It probably is it is the same uh, uh declaration de renta. Yeah, yeah. This, this kind of uh, report, uh, I say report, but it is a statement. Okay. Uh, who is it's who, all, who all, is all, all the, the, all the paper to... or all, all the... No. Eh, como todos los trámites o algo uh -huh. así que... With, uh, like all of the, the, for, um, let me see. Uh, the company has to present to present to give to the for the statement for for the para estado para para la administración de hacienda. Okay. Para el estado de cuenta. 
y también okay. uh, I, th I think I think uh, the tenon are, uh, are a tools for the company. What you have in in, ah. in in devs, I don't know. That is for me. I don't know for you. What what is a financial statement? Veronica. Um, two financial statements, balance sheet and profit and loss. And you have, listen, you have to get a definition for financial statement. That is what you're going to discuss at this moment because you're going to present your definition to the group, but created in the group. Okay. 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 What? is for you, how do you define financial statement, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay, don't go over the next exercise. First, the first one, and from that idea, we're going to get the other ones, okay? Okay. Okay, mm -hmm. hold it, hold it. I know you're anxious to learn, but okay, calm down, calm down. So, Heidi. Ajá. Eh, y el estado de, de, de ganancias y pérdidas también. Ajá, me imagino que ahí va a acabar. Ah, pues pérdidas. No sé cómo se pone. Ganancias. Lo que pasa es que eso yo lo reconozco como pasivo, que son deudas de la empresa con banco, proveedor. No, pero y, y el estado are you, de... Hey, are you ready to share your definition as a group of financial statements? The one that you created? Yes. We are still working on them. <laughs> okay, financial statement to me okay. is this, this, and this, okay? Ah, uh, yes. To yeah. Listen. Uh, okay. yeah, that is what you have. Ah, uh, okay. 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 Yeah. Okay, hello. Are you ready to share with the class your definition for financial statement? Yeah. Yes. Write down, but we talking about it. <laughs> no, but you can, but you can express what uh, you think it could be. Yes. Yeah, we can do it. Yeah, uh, uh, Grace and <laughs> I have I the okay. I, I, yeah, but I don't know if the is the truth. Yeah. That's, that's all. That's that's what you say. <laughs> okay. The thing is that um, uh, how can I tell you? That is the purpose of the activity, right? That you give mm -hmm. your opinion okay. and we share with the other groups. Okay. okay. That is the idea. No. That, no that is the, no, okay. yeah, the idea. To uh to brainstorm. Okay. okay? To get mm -hmm. your ideas mix them and try to figure out what that is. Otherwise it is easier to tell you Google these terms and that is mm -hmm. not the, the, the purpose, okay? So let's yeah. see, ah, Ada Susena is getting. So Ada Susena is going to work with you. You are in group number three, okay? Mm -hmm. Let's wait for her to join the group. And then we're going to share with the class, okay? okay. Okay, teacher. Okay, let's wait for Ancestor is joining. So he's going to be in group number one. You see, sometimes that is why I cannot monitor all the groups because when the students are joining the class, they need to be added. But I don't know, Ada Susena has not joined to your group. Maybe she is having problems with the connection. And, ah, okay, there she is. Ada is with you. Tell her about, okay, the work that we are doing and probably she can give you more ideas, okay? And I'm going to go to room number one to talk to Cesar, okay? Full equity. Okay, listen, girls. Uh, I think that's, that Cesar is going to join you. Okay. 
at this moment because, but I don't know what happened to him. Maybe he's having okay. problems with the connection. Okay, since you are ready, uh, mm -hmm. choose someone who is going to represent you sharing your definition, okay? I guess Lorena, I guess Lorena. <laughs> I get that. I don't I thought that I was still in your group because only your group was here. And I was saying, hey, my God, what <laughs> happened? But when I saw Fredis, I said, okay, we are joining. Okay, get ready to share your definition. We're going to wait for the others. I don't know why they, they don't want to to join the main, main session. Maybe they were working in the other exercise. Uh-huh. I was monitoring all the groups. Oh, we, we didn't even take a look on that. Oh, yes, of course. No, no, really. Uh -huh, yeah. Uh, thank God the, the class is going, is being recorded. So everything when I monitor is uh, there. Yeah. I just mentioned to them that the only word that, that I, all, so one time is cash flow, but the other one. Mm -mm. <laughs> okay, no. okay, okay. So here we go. Let's begin. I need one representative from each group in order to share with the class about the definition that you agreed for the phrase financial statement for that uh, for that phrase. Okay, what is financial statement? What could it be? Okay, volunteers. Hello. Hi. Hi. Okay. Who's going to be representing each group? Uh, my group is Lorena. Okay. Y este, uh, Ana Claudia. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. Lore Lorena and Ana Claudia. Okay. Good. Uh, uh, for us, financial statement is com confused of liabilities, liabilities, assets, liabilities, uh -huh. assets, and complete equity. And what is complete equity? Mm -hmm. What is it about? Complete equity. What is Patrimonio it? Patrimonio completo. Full, full equity, uh, I no. guess it was. Okay. Full equity. Uh -huh. full so equity. you see? Full. Okay. Okay. That's uh -huh. why I told you in simple words, okay? What comes up, you don't have to look in the, in the, in the, in the internet, okay? From Ada Susena, tengo internet porque entrado por la computadora. Really. Okay. So she's going to get back. And... Okay, thank you. We appreciate all those terms are going to be really useful today. Okay, actually, I think you're going to teach. And in the next group, who is going to be the representative? Me okay. Teacher. Okay, yes, Miss Heidi. Hi, okay, you work in a bank, so. Okay. okay. According to Yol Yolanda, Fatima, and, and me, a financial statement is a collection of companies' financial information in order to know about prof proficiency and loss, assets and liabilities uh -huh. in a period of time. Hey, people, you know everything. You know everything about accounting. Okay, so there is no problem. <laughs> Remember, she was at the uh, back. <laughs> yeah, but also Veronica. Okay, good yes. representative. But account Excellent. Accounting Brilliant. in banks is the opposite <laughs> okay. of accounting. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. <laughs> and in Freddy's group, who's going to read or share? Uh, I can uh, share with you what uh, mm -hmm. Wendy and I are talking about it. We don't know some term or one word about like uh, Mr. De Hacienda, how we can say it in English. Uh, because um, it is a noun from El Salvador. Well, it is like a Spanish. A Spanish. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, yeah. We, we, In we, English, uh, they, they have another name. Yeah. Okay. Which is different, I think. Yeah. Okay. So uh, uh, you yeah. associated the term in our reality to some activities that 
are uh, related to our Ministerio de Hacienda, yes? Okay. 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 Well, we are talking um, about the financial statement, our obligation of the company to present to the Ministerio de Hacienda to close a period of time. And, and they have to, to present and pay some money for like, like, like I don't know. In, taxes. Uh, taxes. Uh -huh, taxes. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, another, the financial statement are, la, are like a tool for the company to review one per year or time they have to work and to have the, the administration have a decision how can they are working to, to continue working in the company. Therefore, they are a very important. Uh, Every, everything uh, is, uh, everything that you are saying is for financial uh, statement. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, great. Maybe what they have in English is the threshold. The IRS, okay. IRS means internal revenue services. Okay. The IRS. Uh, mm -hmm. It's the, mm -hmm. uh, uh, it's uh, el equivalente al Ministerio de Equivalent. Mm -hmm. Yes, equivalent. that's okay. right, mm -hmm. the IRS. And, and, and probably for all the, the states, yeah? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you, great. Okay. People, you are Thank amazing. You. Congratulations. You did a pretty good job. So right now, I'm going to share something with you. And you can help me, okay? You're going to help me. And let's see. For today, Mauricio Alberto Ramirez is supposed to be for, with me from 10 to 10.10. 10. Tomorrow, Andres Alberto. Andres, are you here? No. Uh, Cesar Humberto on Wednesday. Karen on Thursday. And Sandra Caroline on Friday, okay? So here we go. Look at this and tell me. I was collecting some terms in order to help you, but you, you know a lot, okay? So we have retained earnings. I need a volunteer to read about retained earnings. What is it about? Okay, uh, Ada, are you back, Ada? Okay, uh, let me see, uh, Cesar, Andres. Yes, teacher, yes, teacher. Okay, Cesar, please read what I have uh, written here about retained earnings, okay? What is it? Okay, retain earnings. The portion of the earnings left with the company after the distribution of dividend to okay. its shareholders. Thank you. And now we continue with companies' assets. Who wants to read that? What volunteer, Yolanda? Hello, Yolanda. Yes, teacher. Okay, would you like to read companies' assets? Okay, companies' assets. What the company owns or possesses. Possesses, possesses, possesses. possesses. Okay. very good. And now liabilities, Wendy, Wendy. Okay, teacher, liability. Liability. Assume liability. It is, no, sorry. It is a summary of the financial balance of an individual organization. Great. Now, incoming cash. Okay. Uh, Freddy? Yes, Freddy, please yep. read about incoming cash. Incoming cash. The money. Wait, wait for me. Teacher, I'm sorry. Yes. I have a doubt. I'm sorry, Freddy. Incoming is not the line that is below. Which no. line below? Uh, the, the money that the company gets and the outcoming <gasps> cash is the one that the company goes Absolutely, at. absolutely right, yeah. Cash coming. Okay. Yes, I remember my income is when I get yeah. money. <laughs> yeah, that's it. 
maybe it moves, right? Mm -hmm. Thank you for telling okay. me. And now we're going to organize this. Thank you, Miss. Okay. I really appreciate that. You're welcome. Okay. Otherwise, imagine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the, the world is upside down. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, Freddy, incoming yeah. cash, this one. Okay. Incoming, incoming cash. The money that the company gets. That's it. Very well. Fatima, mm -hmm. Fatima, Fatima. Fatima, are you here? Okay, I need you to help me reading outcoming cash. Incoming. 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 The money, yeah. the, the money that goes of the company. That goes out of the company because we have in, out, okay? Remember that, in, out, income, outcome, okay? Okay. And then we have, uh, let me see here. This one goes to maybe Ana Claudia. Expenses. Hello, no, I'm so sorry, but I don't listen to you. Maybe if you activate your microphone, okay. It is I'm sorry. It is Monday, that's why, okay. I was talking, okay, expenses, money spent. Okay, that's it. Um, and uh, Heidi, profits? Profits, the difference uh -huh. between the amount earned and the amount spent in buying, operating, or producing something. Okay, and again, retained earnings. We have another definition for retained earnings. Okay, so who wants to read this other definition for retained earnings? Maybe, I don't know, because I don't see everybody. Uh, Ada, Ada, are you back, Ada? Ada Susena. Maybe she's having problems, okay? So I need one volunteer to read the last one. Me, teacher. Please, please. Okay. Retain earnings. The earnings were not paid out to shareholders as dividend. They were instead retained by the company. Very well. Okay. Now... I'm going to stop sharing. And I feel kind of happy because I know that you were working in exercise number two, yes? So you have all the answers absolutely correct. And there is no problem. So I'm going to share with you my screen. And here we go. Okay. So what are you going to do right now? You're going to match the different financial statements with their definitions. And later you are going to compare with a partner. But since almost all of you did it previously, so you're going to work alone, yeah? Do you wanna work alone or again in teams? Alone. Okay, great. Because you have, you have the, the vocabulary previously explained and you research a little bit in the previous exercise, yes? Okay, let's okay. try to do it. And later we're going to discuss as a class. And we're going to learn some terms. The idea is to learn, okay, from others. And remember, don't feel concerned, don't be concerned, don't feel shy. If you are running something because it is natural, it's part of mother nature, we are human beings, we make mistakes, but also we can fix those mistakes, yeah? We can correct those mistakes and nobody's perfect, okay? So let's be empathic and tolerant with the partners. And we have the terms cash flow, but associate them. Don't look for them on internet, okay? Use the definitions and your logic. Cash, you know what it means, right? 
and let it flow, let it flow. Income that comes in the statement. And you have balance sheet and equity statement. Okay, as soon as you are done, you tell me, okay?
teacher, I am done. Ah, you're done. Great. Thank you. And Ana Claudia, too. Okay, great. I think I made that. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, that's great. That's the idea, okay? Okay, what about the rest of the class? Are you still working on that or shall we? Yes, okay. yes teacher, but I don't know if they would. Okay, that's why I am asking you because at this moment I'm going to stop sharing my screen because you're going to get back to your breakout rooms and you're going to discuss and try to get an agreement on that, yes? And after you discuss, we're going to share in the main session room, okay? Are you ready? Here we go. Let me see in the chat, what do I have? Ada Susena is having problems with the, with the connection because she says, if I activate the microphone, I get out the room. I don't know what, what's happening. Okay, so here we go. Mm, one, two, three, four. Okay, I'm going to move. Uh, okay, Cesar. Cesar, hello. Hello. Okay, you are going to work in group number three, okay? Okay, teacher. Yeah, because I have only two students over there. Now, okay. Ah, Ada is coming back. Assigned to group number one. Okay. Now we can go to our breakout rooms. Yolanda, your group is number two. Ada Azucena, your group is number one. Ada? Yolanda, your group is room number two. Ada Azucena, your group is number one. Okay, great. Si nos escucha, nos escucha. Bueno, había que hacer, hay que estamos trabajando en la página 39. Uh -huh. Y hay que hacer match de esos términos con la, con lo que significa. Uh -huh. Ay, perdón. ¿Y quién es Verónica Guada? Yo, yo no, yo a vos te sé, pero se suponía que Ada así está. Bueno, she was down in. Entonces, okay. Well, but I don't know if she hears us. Okay, uh, where did you uh, put the letter A, the cash flow? Um, for the cash flow is uh -huh. Sumaris is um, a company uh -huh. Sumaris in, uh, incomes expenses are profit. Oh, well. Number four. Okay. Number four. What do you think? Equity, equity. What is equity? Equity. Um, for equity, I have a summary of the company's income, expenses, and profit over a period of time, but I don't know. I have a doubt. I think that's the balance sheet summarizes. I, I think the balance, balance sheet is um, is a report a company assess the abilities in, in the answer number two. Assets 
and liabilities. I think that is balanced sheet. Fatima, what do you think? Uh, report a company asking liability and earnest quality a given point. Is number one. Uh, number two. For me, number two. <laughs> number two. Uh, uh, reports a company assets liabilities and owner's quality at a given point in time. <clears throat> I I associate that um, the equipment payment with uh, the owner of quality quality. Mm -hmm. Proprietarios, sí. the company. Therefore, I say number three and number two. Teacher, uh, how is the pronunciation? Liabilities? Liabilities. 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 Ah, okay. Okay. Liabilities. Thank you. Okay, uh, Wendy. What do you think? Uh, in my case, uh, number C, no, sorry, uh, letter C Rassi. is number two, but uh, next, here you, <laughs> uh, here you, Cesar and Fredis, maybe number one. <laughs> if it oh, change, no. uh, number you know, in, in, in the case, is number two. The yeah. RC is number two. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I have a letter, letter G and number two. Uh, and number no. C and number one. But no, I, yeah, I, I wrong. Yes, letter number C. Yeah, because letter D letter is C. number one. Letter D. Yeah. Okay. It comes statement. No, letter D. No, D. Uh -huh, yes, number B is number four. Letter B is number four. No, it's letter D. D. Letter D. Letter balance D. sheet. Okay. Balance sheet. One. Balance sheet. Balance sheet is number one. Okay. Mm -hmm. I, yes. I change. Repasando un poco. Eh, cash flow. Cash, cash flow number three. Income statements number four. Equity statement. No. Uh -huh. okay. ¿Dónde, le va, ¿Dónde le dé el avance? Exacto. Pues sí, esas son las que tenemos que hacer diariamente. <laughs> No, hay una tarea. La discusión. Ah. ¿Ah? ah, me perdí. Teacher, nosotros ya comparamos y estamos todas dispares. <risa> ah, ¿qué? Ajá. Yes, revenge. Ya, para de aquí ahí está you get an agreement. Ah, yes, to standardize ideas. The only one we have in agreement, I guess, is the letter C. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, get an agreement. Okay. That's why it okay. is a discussion. Ah, okay. Uh, Not only a comparison. Okay. Okay, let's start. So, cash comparison flow. is. Uh -huh. Comparison, I'm sorry. Comparison. Okay. Eh, entonces, cash flow. Eh, ustedes dos sí la tenían en, el, en la número. Okay. <laughs> Are you done? After we finish, we finish, teacher. And you got finish. an agreement. You got an agreement yes. of the ideas. Yes. Okay, yes. great. Because you have to present your point and you have to uh, say why, okay? With your why? partners. Why you uh, think this is the correct word and this is the correct definition, okay, for the word, for the term. Yeah. 
Okay. Now we're going to get back to the main session room. Okay. Okay, let's wait for the other partners. Okay, so I think that, okay, here we go. Okay, people, tell me, uh, we're going to listen to your opinions, okay? And here we go. I need one representative from each group in order to share uh, the result of your discussion with the class. And later we're going to get an agreement, yeah? Because we need to standardize ideas based on what you have researched and based on what you have uh, discussed, yes? Okay, so who is going to be the representative in Miss? Ana Claudia's group, who is going to represent that group? Lorena. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her face. Okay. Lorena, do you want to? Yes? Okay. Yeah. We have the first representative, Lorena. That's great. And um, in Haiti's group, who's going to be the representative? Who's going to be presenting? Teacher, Yolanda. We, we, Yolanda. Okay, we, Yolanda is going to present. <laughs> okay, and uh, in Cesar and Freddy's group, who's going to be presenting? Me, teacher. Uh, Fatima. No, Wendy. Wendy, I'm uh, sorry, because I, I, okay, now you are close to, to Cesar, okay? Okay, Wendy, great, very good. So we are all ears in order to uh, begin, but I have Lorena, Yolanda, and Wendy. So I am going to write one number in the palm of my hand. Do you see? Nothing, yes? And no. Lorena, Yolanda, and only girls. Lorena, Yolanda, and Wendy, they have to guess from one to three, and the person, the girl who guesses the number is going to be the first one, okay? Yes, okay, so. Okay, so tell me. Lorena, tell me a number from one to three. Uh, uh, literal A. No, 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 no. You have to choose one number from one to three. Tiene que decirme un nombre, un número del uno al tres. Okay. Three. Excuse me? Three. Number three? Yes. Okay, you are the lucky one. So you're going to begin presenting for the class. But before we start presenting, I'm going to check your second attendance, okay? Ada Susena, Ada, okay. Ada Susena is having problems with the audio, but she is here and she is answering in the chat. Ana Claudia? Here, teacher. Great. Andres Alberto? Not here. Cesar Humberto? Here, teacher. Right. Thank you. 
And we go. So, Fatima, Fatima. Yes, okay, great, great. Francis is not here. Freddy's. Freddy's. Okay. Heidi. Heidi. Here, Miss. Okay, great. Hugo, she's, he's at work. Uh, Karen. She's absent. Liliana Melissa is absent. Lorena, Loren, here. Great. Milagros, absent. Mauricio, uh, Patricia Janet, Sandra Carolina, Verónica, Verónica Yesenia Enrique yes, Jarevalo. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> here I am. Wendy, Wendy Patricia. Present teacher. Social. Yolanda. Yolanda. Okay, great. Present. Great, thank you. Okay, now let's begin with the lucky one, number three. Lorena. Okay, you begin, Lorena. Okay, let's see. I'm going to share the screen. So we can have a, a better panorama. Yeah. Okay. Yes, Miss. Uh, letter A. Letter. No. Letter you tell you A. tell me number because you have to move the letter to the numbers. Okay. You have to associate the words to the definition. So tell me. For number one in your group, it is letter. Three, la tres. La tres. Okay. okay. La tres. Listen. For you, letter A is number three. Okay. Yes. For you. Okay. For your group. Inco yes. Okay. No. She didn't hear. She didn't hear what you say. <laughs> Lorena, you just Hola. need to number. For example, for us, the number one is letter. X, Y, Z. Number two is letter D. Number three, letter okay. D. Number, number three. Yes, I start number one. And then no, so on. Tres. El tres, one. Number three. Okay, number what three. is for you, number three? Okay. Equity statement. Okay, for Report. you, number three is letter C. Yes, Miss. Letter C. Okay. Letter C. Okay, letter C. Very well. Continue with the other numbers. Uh, letter A. Mm -hmm. Cash flow. Cash flow. Cash flow. Number four. Okay, for your group, cash flow is number four. Okay, number four is letter A. Yes, okay. continue. Letter, letter B. Income statement uh, number uh, number three. Mm? Again, number 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 three. Income Two times. Statement. No, but you number. told me that number three is letter C. No, was incorrect. Was incorrect. Correct. Incorrect. Okay, so number three for you is letter B. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. In number letter, two. letter C, equity sta statement uh, number two. Okay. Uh, letter D, balance sheet number one. Okay. Now, Yolanda, what is the version of your group for the possible okay. answers? Okay, teacher, for us, the possible answer we think about um, uh, cash flow, we think is level three. Okay, so for you, number three is letter A, yes? Yes. Okay. Yes. Um, 
income statement for us, it could be um, for definition number one. Repeat, which is number one for you? Uh, in income statement. B, for B as in beautiful is number one for you, yes? Cash flow is number, definition number three. Cash flow. Yes. Okay, income statement for us, uh, definition number one. Okay. And equity, equity statement, we think that it will be definition number four. And balance sheet for definition number two. Absolutely different from the first group. Okay, Wendy. Okay, teacher, for us, uh, number one is letter D. Letter D as in day. Yeah. Okay, letter balance D. sheet. Okay. Balance sheet, okay. Yeah. And number two is letter C. Equity statement, uh, number three, letter A. Cash flow. Okay. And number four, letter B, income statement. Okay. There are just a few coincidences, right? So let's see. Let's go over this. Uh, we have uh, two groups that keep the idea that number one, yeah, is letter D, the cash flow for group number one and group number three in the order of presenting, okay? You're presenting. Cash flow for these uh, two groups summarizes a company's incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time. And for, let's see. Yeah, that's what you said. That cash flow is what summarizes a company's incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time. And then we have for two groups that equity statement is the report a company assets, liabilities, and owners quality at a given point in time. And we have a four, another coincidence? No, only those ones. Yes? Only those. And group number two, Yolanda's group has different. Only, 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 Number three has the same as when this group. And they state that number three is letter A, as I told you at the beginning, okay? Reports, cash flow uh, reports on a company's incoming and outcoming of cash. It's operating, investing, and financing activities. Okay. So thank you very much. And let's see, balance sheet, what is it? It is the statement or financial position, okay? It is a summary of the financial balances of an individual or organization. So we have that balance sheet goes to which number? Balance sheet goes to number? Two? Number, number four. four. Number, number four. One. Mm. Number, number one. Number one. Number one. No. No. Read again, again the, 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 the definition. definition. The balance sheet is the statement or financial position. Okay. It is a summary of the financial balances of an individual or organization. That is the balance sheet. So it goes to letter D goes to number. Number okay. two, reports a company's assets, liabilities, and ownership 
owner's quality at a given point in time. Yes. Why, Miss? Why, Miss Yolanda? Because I see that he is talking about access and liabilities. And I know that I, I access and liabilities from activos y pasivos. Yes, that's it. Okay, so the balance sheet is talking about assets and liabilities. Okay. For me, and, it's, it's that. Okay. And what about cash flow? Cash so the letter flow. D goes, goes in the number two? Uh-huh. And cash okay. flow? Cash flow? It is the cash, okay? okay? The one that you can uh use okay the cash flow teacher for me it's number three because the cash flow is a uh, out, mm -hmm. outcoming incoming cash it is the it's flujo. yeah flujo it's dinero. operating for me it's operating three two yeah it's operating investing and financing activities yes yeah so, so the number three is letter B. No. no. The cash flow is letter A. Is letter A number three? Oh, I'm yeah, sorry. that's sorry. it. That's it. That's it. A number three. Okay. Okay. So now we have income statements. Income. Today has to be number four. So, so summarize is the company incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time. For me, three. No, but the three already said right? Four. Listen, okay. listen, income statement is the one that gets into the company. Yes. That's why it summarizes a company's incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time. Mm -hmm. Before. Okay, but remember that I, I, I gave you at the beginning two definitions for earnings retained, yes? Mm -hmm. Because depending on the situation here, it might change. And which is the equity statement? Is one reports on changes in retained earnings of a company during the state period. Thank you. Do you agree, people? Hello. The equity statement reports on the changes in retained earnings of a company during the stated period. I don't know. It is uh, the only missing one. Uh, we in the book. In, in, in okay, Freddy. Two. Uh -huh. In group number two, we uh, say no. The statement is number is number eleven C in number two, but uh -huh. and now I can hear that uh, maybe I am, we are wrong. We are not sure now. <laughs> uh huh. Because they are kind of similar, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Somebody can. Eat because it is a specialized accounting accounting vocabulary, right? Okay, so which is the missing one? Hello. The number four or, or what? I I I lost one second and I couldn't hear that D was in number one. <laughs> For me, number two, I don't know okay, the, the vocabulary counting. <laughs> but number two, at the beginning, uh, you say that it was letter D. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
That is the only one that I took note. Number two, letter D, number three, letter A, right? Okay, right? let's see, let's see. Okay, let's summarize it again. Ah, uh, please. Okay, so we said income statement. Letter B, where, uh, which number, which is the definition for income statement? Number four. Summarizes a company's incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time. So that is the number in the number four letter B. That is the correct answer. Is that the correct answer? Because uh, we could say also that from another point of view, that balance sheet is uh, what summarizes a company's income expenses and profits over a period of time. What we call the tax that every company uh, provides to the, to the, in El Salvador to our Ministerio de Hacienda, right? Mm -hmm. About the taxes, yes or no? Yes. That's why I was telling you, and I was for uh, number four from the beginning, and I was pointing, which one, like this, which one is balance sheet, mm -hmm. yes? At the end, because it is at the end of the year, what summarizes, right? So number four goes letter D. And now the cash flow. Is number two. Number two reports a company's assets, liabilities, and owners quality at a given point in time. Is that the is number that, Is that, three? okay. Oh, teacher, the cash flow is number, number three. Yeah, that's it. Reports on a company's incoming and outcoming of cash, it's operating, investing, and financing activities, yeah? Okay. And it is shared with the stockholders, equity, yeah? So we go with number three, letter, C, yeah? And now let's see, number two, reports a company's assets, liabilities, and owner's qual quality. Okay. Mm -hmm. For me, it's letter D because letter D have a liabilities in assets. Assets. The ba I said, sorry, uh, the, bala the balance. The balance sheet. But the only letter missing it was the letter B. Yeah, yeah, but I, I knew. <laughs> <I'm gonna learn. laughs> really I know, I'm you. so confused because I, I don't know nothing about accounting. <laughs> I, I have, I have, teacher, okay. I have a psychology, no accounting. <laughs> <laughs> you are an accountant. Wendy, you are an accountant. No, I am a psychologist. <laughs> ah, okay. Karen is, Karen is uh, uh, ah, uh -huh. mm -hmm. So here we go, right? But let's do it because we have been researching and uh, let's see. I'm going to share again so, so you can double think about your answers in here do you remember maybe this is gonna help you okay expenses money spent incoming cash the money that the company gets outcoming cash the money that goes out of the company liabilities or liabilities a summary of the financial balances of an individual or organization companies assets what the company owns or possesses Retain earnings, the portion of the earnings left with the company after the distribution of dividend to its shareholders. And also we have uh, profits, the difference between the amount earned and the amount spent in, um, sorry, but I, I, I don't see because I'm going to minimize this okay, for a while. The amount spent in buying, operating, or producing something, and then retained earnings again. The earnings 
that were not paid out to shareholders as dividends. They were instead retained by the company, okay? Yes? So, hello, I'm going to stop presenting this and we're going to get back to the book, to the manual. Okay. That's why it is two hours for this discussion. <laughs> yeah. It is only this, the topic, the accounting, the accounting, okay? So based on that, let's do it again. Miss Heidi, where are you? Heidi, Heidi, hello. Heidi, are you here? Hello, hello. Okay, so let's see. Once again, we agree that uh, number four was balance sheet. Why? Because uh, it summarizes a company's incomes, expenses, and profits over a period of time that is presented to the government. Yeah? Yes. Yeah? In order to pay the taxes. And then we have number three, reports on a company's incoming and outcoming of cash. It's operating and uh, vesting and financing activities. That what we say is a cash flow. The cash flow. Mm -hmm. That is what with the majority think <laughs> it makes sense. Yeah, but the thing is that uh, the cash flow is what the company the company has. Yes. Okay. So yeah, because they can can count on that. And number two, reports a company's assets, liabilities, and owners' quality at a given point in, in time. Do you remember what I, what I shared with you about liabilities? Okay, one more time, but pay attention please. Okay, I know that is new and kind of confusing. Uh, liabilities, <laughs> it is a summary of the financial balances of an individual or organization. And we have also companies' assets, what the company owns or possesses. You have the key here. The company's asset is what the company owns or possesses. And another key is liabilities. It is a summary of the financial balances of an individual or organization. Yeah? So let's get back. <laughs> Sorry, teacher. <laughs> number number two is maybe letter C. No. <laughs> okay, number two, letter C. Reports companies assets liabilities and owners quality at a given point. Yeah, equity, and you have quality owners quality. Okay. So what if we move? Uh, number two, letter C. And then we have, yeah, according to the definition that I gave, the cash flow. Then we have number one, reports on the changes in retained earnings of a company during a stated period. Letter B. Letter, sorry. B? Let, no. 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 <laughs> <laughs> My goodness, all I this work. Hmm? Remember, I told you a balance sheet is a statement or financial position. It is a summary of the financial balances of an individual or organization. Yes. 
It can also be, what else? What did I tell you? It can also okay. be shared by an individual or organization or a group of shareholders. So letter D, the number one, sounds like letter D or what? No. No, I'm confused. I don't know nothing about the accounting. <laughs> no, no. But here, you just have to associate. Please, let's do it. Teacher, A is uh, letter A is number three. Letter B is number four. Is the correct? No, we stated that number four is letter D as in day. Yes? As in David, yes. Yes, as in David, as in day. And number two, letter C. Now we are still looking for the correct in number one and number three. But look at this, please. And associate. Okay. A company's assets is what the company owns or possesses. Liabilities, it is a summary of the financial balances of an individual or organization. Yeah? Profits, the difference between the amount earned and the amount spent in buying, operating, or producing something. Mm -hmm. The company's assets, what the company owns or possesses. And the retained earnings, the earnings that were not paid, obviously, out to the shareholders as dividends. They were instead retained by the company. Okay, so now the final because later you have to discuss these terms regarding to your company. Only the ones that you consider, okay? So here we go, imagine almost two hours in this, and that is why, <laughs> according to the plan uh, of, the, of the company is because it is kind of confusing. So here we go. In number one, let's focus in number one, cash flow. Yes, Yolanda, in your opinion, what is cash flow? In my opinion, teacher, um, I found thinking it's number three, reports of a company coming in our coming of cash. Cash flow? Yes. That's it. And now we have number one. Which is the missing? If we said that number, number four yeah. is letter D, number three is letter A, and number two is letter C, which is the one for number one. Letter B. Letter B. Uh -huh. The income statements reports on the changes in retained earnings of a company during the stated period. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and now you have to go to your groups and you have to discuss this. Hi, where is it? Okay. Here, again, look at this. You have to work in your small groups and you are going to discuss with a partner the following ideas. Share your opinion and give reasons. Number one, it's not so important to know about the incomes and outcomes a company has, what do you think? For you as employees, do you consider that it is not so important to know about the incomes and outcomes a company has? Is it important or not important and why? Number two, last year, a company's owner fired many people. The owner carried such actions to save the company. Do you agree, partially agree, or disagree? Do you consider it was a good idea to fire many people in order to make the company survive? And number three, it is mandatory for everybody to check on his or her profits to see how much can be invested or spent. 
Is it an obligation for everybody to check on his or her profits to see how much can they invested or spent in the company? What do you consider? And you give your reason. So you have these three cases are the point of discussion at this moment, okay? Yeah, but you have what to give your invested? opinion. Ah, uh, hello? What is? What is invested? Invested. Invertido. What is invested? Invertido. Ah, okay. Cuando invierte en un negocio. Can be invested or spent. Invertido o gastado. If it is mandatory or if it is an obligation for everybody to check on his or her profits, ganancias, to see how much can be invested or spent. If you say, yes, I consider it is a must. It is mandatory, it is an obligation, but you have to say why, okay? Imagine that you are the owners of the company. Is that clear what you're going to discuss? Yes? Ah, hey, D, hello, welcome. Okay, people, so are you clear about the three points of discussion? And listen, forget about uh, the employee mind. You have to think like if you are running, like if you are the owner of the company. Because if you if you if you think as an as an employee, you're going to say no. It is not fair that uh, you know that the company fires a lot of uh, people in order to save the company in order to make it survive. Yes, you have to think like if you are a businessman, a businesswoman, if the company belongs to you, okay, and you have to give the reasons and the consequences, okay? So now let's get ready to discuss those topics in the groups and later everybody in each group is going to give a point. So you have three points in there. Everyone is going to present one point in front of the class, okay? And here we go. Hey, uh, Yolanda, who was with you in room number two, Yolanda, yes, ¿quién, es, ¿quién estaba con usted en el, en el equipo 2? Because Heidi. you are alone. Heidi. And Fátima. And Fátima. Okay, I'm going to send uh, Heidi again. Okay. I'm going to open Ada Susena. Is uh, to room number two. And. Heidi, room number two. And now I think I have three, 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 okay? Heidi, your room is number two. Veronica, your room is number one, okay? Veronica, number one. Veronica, your room is number one, okay, great. <laughs> I, am, I, am, I am laughing because of a, of a picture that someone sent to the to the group. <laughs> okay, but oh, you know the the thing is that the the method is a student center, yeah. And Insa for wants you to be discussing and producing and getting to the point. That's why. Okay. Because you need to be. So that is the situation. So sorry for that, but that is <laughs> in order to make you talk, Just, in order to make you discuss. Okay. okay. And I think that that is the intention why they uh, put it in that way, right? Kind of confusing. <laughs> I think I think that sorry. is the only way. And you, oh my God. Okay. No, but I have had some groups, some uh, accountants, and it is kind of, uh, you know. But she is not here, Karen. <laughs> no, in other groups. I have ah. had more than one accountant and uh, the definitions are kind of extremely similar. Yeah. Ah, uh, they are a little confused. Like, yeah. So ah. the point is to make you reflect and to make you talk. Yeah. To create to a discussion so for you. Yeah. yeah <laughs> with a headache. So that's why I was like, mm -hmm. 
I have lived this before, okay? Ah, so, okay. but now it is over. So discuss these three points, which are part of our reality, yeah? Okay. Okay. Bye. So if they are three, bye. Uh -huh. uh, we have here three points of discussion, girls. So the teacher said we need to present what uh, each one. Uh, yeah, one of but them, you, have, right? you have to discuss the three. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, you discuss so, the three. Okay. And In this one case, of this... you is going to be this, the presenting one of them. Okay. Ah, you have okay. to present the three. One, two, okay. three, for example, but you have to discuss the three. So everybody knows ah, okay. about what it is about. Okay. Ah, okay, okay. Bye. So let, let's say, bye teacher. Let's say in the number one. Uh, it's important because. Uh -huh. I thought that you already had the answers in the previous exercise <laughs> because at the beginning you were discussing that. <laughs> no, I mean in all the groups, in all the groups. So, so uh -huh. mm -hmm. but they are, they have a slight difference and they are really confusing, right? Yes, yes. Yeah, and that is the purpose because it makes you discuss, yeah, and talk. That's the, that's an idea. Okay. That's because it is a student centered. Okay. You are the stars. Not me, unfortunately. Okay. Fortunately. That is what they want to see when they watch the videos. Okay. So in progress discussing. Okay. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. Continue, please. Discussing okay. the three. Topics that are very interesting. Yes, they are topics yeah. for employees and for the owners of a company. Sometimes you are like against the wall, right? And decisions are really difficult. Okay. 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 See you later. See you later, teacher. So, it, 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 la dos dice, last year at. at okay. Uh, Number two is last year a company's owner fired many many people. The owner carried such action to save the company. Fire es cerrar o, o perder o algo así perder. No, es este como despedir. Despedido, ajá, despedido. Ah, de okay. Ajá, ajá. And, and actually, may I? tell you something, it is something similar to the reality that many people lived last year around the world, right? Because mm -hmm, of the yes. pandemic, yeah? So it is nowadays an updated topic. It is a very hard decision. Okay, yeah. continue yeah. discussing. Uh, maybe, maybe it, for like, like, he, like if I can be uh, the owner of the company, we, I, I choose to talk with the employees, with the other people to say, maybe we want to fire you in this moment, but when the company get, get back to better to work, to we want to call you to work again. Yeah. Um, because if maybe the, the company is has to the bad situation, he has to, to close for one month, two months. After that, to open the company, uh, I can say the people, when the company is open, I will call you back again. Yeah, is maybe in own uh, company are, but other, no, other close, uh, close in, in, anymore open but the companies uh, may be uh, action savvy uh, is, 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 is down the cost down the cost and have a politic uh, that buscalo mi amor uh, the politics, uh, I don't know, is the reduction the cost, reduction the cost, cost reduction, cost reduction. Maybe uh, the company save it. Mm -hmm, yes. Or, or change, 
or change your product or your service. Uh, because uh, my case, I have a, a, a restaurant. I, I, I am a, a employee, but I have a restaurant too. And they close for pandemic, but I change my, my, my business. I have, today I have a, a, a barroteria. Una barroteria. Okay. Y, and my, my, my money uh, cash flow too. But it's necessary change the, the business. Mm, uh, I think uh, fire uh, employees a dif difficult decision uh, because the, the pandemic uh, cause many many uh, companies closures yeah. and and they were not not other solution uh, other companies uh, how how say uh, Wendy uh, or de operaciones en, en línea educativa quizás uno unos 50 de las una de las cuatro sedes que nosotros tenemos en el Salvador. Wow, bastante uh -huh. gente. Pues sí, pero vaya, no era lo lo, eh, lo más no que nos, Ajá, pero me imagino que se buscaron otro tipo de de, sí. de salida lo y fue la fue, única para sí, no afectar más porque, gente. Fíjate, fíjate que realmente fue como que lo extremo porque ah, con nosotros cuando se dio lo de la pandemia nos estuvieron pagando como English. seis meses. Ah, ok. Sí, English, this is la teacher. English. Try, try, try. Ok, you can do it, but try. Uh -huh. Try to uh -huh. say it in English. Ah. Ya, ya. Ya me cayó el teacher, ya me cayó. No, you, need, you can. Let's, let's do it. Ah, Susan. Uh, I the know. pandemic affects you in the negative way. Never, never has been done. Hello, uh, uh, sorry for the interruption, but Ada was calling me. Ah, okay. Uh, Ada, I am here, Ada. <clears throat> ah, she went out. I think she's having problems with the connection, right? I'm sorry for the interruption. Continue with the discussion, please. Okay. So... I don't know what do you think. Hey. We have a top uh, uh, on number three because um, uh -huh. for some for some companies it might be mandatory for everybody to 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 know to divulgar or publicar to publish to publish or to spread uh -huh, the profits, but not to everyone. It, it, uh, yeah, it is like tricky, right? Mm -hmm. But especially for the private enterprises, mm -hmm. it is not, uh, it is not uh, like a law, at least in our country. But for the government, for the government, it is supposed, yes? Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because we have the, Transparency office, something like that. La oficina de transparencia, yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it is about that, and also the the Ministerio de Hacienda, right? Mm -hmm. But they 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 don't share with uh, everybody about those issues because it is like risky, yeah. Yeah, but you know, for example, banks. They have to publish that information on, on, yes. on those papers. On the newspapers, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, for, for example, in my company, teacher, there is no... no They're not bound to do it. It, 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 it is not possible. It's not an obligation. They're not obligated. It is not a must. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. It is up to them to publish yes. it or not, yeah? But for the banks, according, probably there is a law, yes? 
a law mm -hmm. that makes them do it in the newspaper to broadcast in the newspaper, right? Exactly. Yeah. So everybody knows because uh, almost everybody has something to do with the banks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, and they do it maybe because uh, people who invest need uh, to know which bank is it's better on the, on their administration. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And also the backups that they have. Yeah. Okay. okay. So, so it is not mandatory for everybody. Yeah, I think so. Let me see. It is not mandatory. Okay. For everybody. Okay. For everybody. So you're done. Are you done? Oh, almost done. Almost. Ah, okay, great. So I'm going to move to the other groups. Okay. And here. Bankruptcy. 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 Uh huh. Okay, we discuss. Now, now the topic is better, right? Because I see that we're happily discussing, not like in the previous <laughs> one, which was a headache. Yeah. Oh, the other Because we're one. not accountants. Exactly. No, yeah. they are so similar. So similar. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we are in an agreement with the three of them. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have uh, Veronica, Yesenia, Enrique Sarevalo. I Hi. have Lorena and me. Okay, great. And I have in room number two. But today, I think that uh, who has been having a lot of problems to be in class is uh, is Carol. Ada? Or who? Yeah, Ada. She has been in, in problems uh, with the connection, I think. Okay, continue talking, okay? Continue talking okay. as okay. time flies. And we're okay. going to present. Because these uh -huh. topics are really interesting. Yes, they yes. are interesting. Mm -hmm. Better than they, the first one, yeah? Because it is about okay. terms. So let's forget about it. Yeah, this is the what, concerns. Okay. Oh, okay. my battery is dying. I'm sorry, I'm going to plug in the computer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Yes, but it's giving me five minutes, so I'm still at time. <laughs> okay. Teacher. Yes. What do you say? Last option or last choice? Resource or last resource. Or last, uh, uh -huh, or last resource. Last resource. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Last resource. What, uh, no, what no. is the one that sounds better? Because, for example, yeah, they are we... kind of synonyms. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Last option. Yes, because we think in the number two, it's like at the last option the owner's company may. Mm -hmm. But it depends on the on the owner's uh, you know point of view, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, that is the reason why Veronica was uh, sharing to us yeah. uh, her company experience. A lot of people have been fired in many companies because of the pandemic, right? Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the ones who have a job now are blessed. Um, yeah. Amen. Amen, yeah, sister. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. Yeah, because a lot of people are looking for a position. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. So continue preparing. Okay. Bye. See you in five minutes or three okay. minutes. Ah, okay. 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 So I uh, say so that they, it is mandatory to show that how much they can uh, they so she gave profile in order to to can be say how much I have it, how much I can be invested, or how much we spend it.
Okay. Uh, in my case, I I think too uh, he is necessary. He is necessary uh, to know to know the productivity that the uh, that company and and how. Eh, ¿Cómo se dice rentable, teacher? And how... Profitable. 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 Yeah. Profitable. Uh, how profitable is the is the company for the for the owners and the employees? Yeah, because el gerundio dice complete the conversation with the student no, form no, of the no. first. No es eso. Ahí. No es eso. Ok. Ada, Ada, are you okay with the audio? Ada, Susana. No, she still has problems. Ok, people, are you ready to present to the class? Yes, ok. Here we go. Okay, everybody's here. Here we go. Um, I am all ears for you. Okay, so who wants to start with the first uh, topic? Because we have three. Volunteers? Me, teacher. Okay, please, Cesar Humberto, be our guest. Uh, the Number one or the three? No, only one. Only one. You choose. Uh, okay. It can be one, two, or three. Okay. Okay. Uh, number number one. Okay. It, it's now so important to know about the incomers and outcomes a uh, company has. Uh, I think it is uh, very important because it's necessary to know how much cash we have in the company to cover expenses. Okay, yeah. mm -hmm. that's it. Thank, Thank you very you. much, great. And now let's see uh, for the same uh, issue. And uh, hey, this group, what's your point? Uh in your group. We were saying that um, the same as the other group, but also we think it's wrong because uh, you can be, you have to be careful so you won't have higher outcomes than the money that comes into the company. Okay, great. And what about the next group, the other group? What's your position? One volunteer from the other group. Our group team, uh, teacher? Yes. Okay, uh, for the number one, yes, it's very important um, to know about the incomes and outcomes because we have the, the vision on how the company is working, where the company is going on. So for us, yes, we agree it's very important. Okay, <clears throat> now let's see. The second issue, the second situation. Who wants to share? Me, teacher. Yes, Miss Yolanda. Okay, and in in our case, we think we are partially agreed because there are other ways to get lower cost costs. For example, reducing some benefits to the to the employees. That would be the alternative, alternative, in your opinion, in your group's yes, opinion. Yes. Okay, good, thank you. In order to keep uh, all the employees, yeah, with a salary. Yeah, okay, good. And uh, do we have any other opinion from the other groups? About uh, number two, house yes. Teacher. Uh, about uh, number two. 
Okay. And for us opinion, uh, to have to action to save the company. Number one, reduce the journal work. Uh, number two, change uh, a strategic, uh, the change strategic. For example, change product or change the service for a more competitive in the time. Only that. Okay, thank you. Uh, someone else who would like another idea? Who would like to share another idea? <clears throat> now let's go over the third point, okay? Uh, let me see. Who wants to begin sharing your opinions about the third point? Do you agree, partially agree, disagree, or what do you suggest? Hello. Nobody. Miss, we were saying that it's not mandatory to every company. It's depending on the on logs or economic activity. For example, banks do have to publish their their balances on those papers. Yeah, that's it. And but it is not mandatory for all the companies, right? Exactly. But for the banks, yes, it is because it is supposed that all the people have to read. Yes, but people don't read. <laughs> <laughs> Only the government, yes, that's it, because a lot of pages and the letter is really, really tiny in the in the newspaper, yeah. So you say, oh my God, no, I'm not going to read this. Where to invest. Yeah. That information must help. Okay, great. Any other's opinion? Someone else who would like to share? No. About the last point, number three, nobody. In case uh, the company owner is in the business of investment, or for example, uh, uh, investing in bonus, I don't know if that is the correct word. Okay. Bonus. Bonus. And operating, also if he's uh, operating in the New York, what? <laughs> What's the name of your? <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Was industry. it? Uh -huh. If somebody is investing in those kind of industry, of course, it's mandatory because they need to know how much they would be investing in this and this other step. Or if they need to be quiet, or they will need to make a pause on their maybe think on another strategy. That is what we were discussing in our group, depending also in the business. Okay, it depends on the business, right? On the kind of business. Very well. So as you see, uh, the last unit is quite interesting, right? But the, the issue is, is quite interesting because we're going to learn. We're going to learn vocabulary yeah. and terms. The yeah? new vocabulary. Yeah, the thing is this that we uh, those words are not familiar to us because we are not in that field so that is why it is kind of confusing but at the end you're going to say ah this is the one okay so people i hope to see you tomorrow and remember to continue working with the exercises online yeah in the platform why because this is the last week and I'm going to check your attendance the last time, okay? okay? So here we go. Let's see. Ada, Ada Susena. Ah, she's here, but she's having problems with the, with the audio. Ana Claudia here, is teacher. here, yes. Andres is not here. Cesar? Cesar is not here. Okay. Fatima, Fatima, she wrote in the chat, probably she is having problems. Francisca is not here.
Freddy's, David yeah, Rivas, yeah. always yeah, okay. here. Heidi, here, miss. Always here. Hugo, we have problems. Karen, she's not here. And Liliana, Melissa, she's. Liliana Melissa, she's absent, right? Hello, Lorena is here. And they said, eh, Maria Milagros is absent. Mauricio is absent. Patricia Janet Barrera absent. Sandra Carolina, today she was absent. Verónica Yesenia, present teacher. Wendy, Patricia. Here, teacher. Okay, thank you very much. Social absent, Yolanda, here. here I mentioned here. everybody, right? Okay, so tomorrow we're going to have a brief review about the terms and, uh, well, we're going to go over something different, okay? But you're going okay. to learn new terms and you know that the second part was more kind of friendly to you, yes? Because you are not related to the terms. That's why they were like, oh my God, this. But tomorrow it is something different, okay? Thank you for being in class. I hope to see you tomorrow. Remember, this is the last week. Try not to skip classes, try to be in class. and sweet dreams okay thank you teacher. bye bye you, god bless bye. you good night everybody thank you for good being in class bye bye god bless good you night. bye bye take everybody. care bye. God bless you. have a good night bye bye take care okay bye take care bye bye okay